Bond 2020. Okay, so... James Bond... Okay, so... Bond 25, right? Uh, let's see, how does this work? Uh, writers, stars... Wait, is this- is this the person that's gonna play James Bond? What? No? Okay, alright. Uh, James Bond- alright, James Bond 25 official trailer. Wait, is it fake? Bond 25 is Craig. No, I I'm confused here. Like, it's fake? What the fuck, man? Why can't you guys just tell me what it is? Okay, Games Radar. James Bond 25 release date. Um, Heel vs. Babyface did a video on it. Really? I don't see it. Female 2007 cast in James Bond. Meet your new 007. James Bond is 100% woke. Men are outdated. Oh my god. Okay. The top one. Uh, oh, right. License to respect women. This is 17 minutes. I don't know if I want to go through the whole thing, right? Um, oh, okay. Just a minute. I, I want to watch like the first like minute or two, then we'll go Hi back. Hi everyone, and, uh... as here from Heel vs. Okay. Babyface. Is this actually so what I think it is? the last couple of days, I've been seriously harassed online. Uh, no, no, not about them. From people asking me to talk about this. Oh, I thought it was about my audience. Come oh, on, naughty. Uh, yeah, for people asking me about my opinion about this this James Bond news. Uh, so if, you, if you're unaware, just very quickly, uh, there's a leak, apparently, that in the latest James Bond film, okay. 007 is going to be played by a female black actress, uh, Lashana Lynch, British lady, uh, in the film. So, okay, I'm going to just jump in with my uh, my opinion about this and there's gonna be like two sides to the video there's gonna be my side of i wonder what would happen if they had a guy play wonder woman you know i, I mean i i to, to me like if they did that i would say to myself i would be like you know what this movie's probably gonna be really really shitty because there's wonder woman sh is a it's a girl right i mean i, I i'm sorry to say but like this is this is ridiculous. There would be outrage. It would be fucking outrage. The video, and then there's going to be another side of the video, which will become more apparent. But before I go into that, I just want to kind of give you my uh, thoughts on James Bond as a, as a whole, as an entity. Um, I'm a big, I am legit a big Bond fan. Uh, I've been a big Bond fan all my life since I was a little kid. Uh, I was brought up on the Sean Connery films. Fuck and yeah, the, dude. Those are the best. Uh, Roger Moore films. Fuck yeah. And uh, I really like Sean Connery's a god. take on Bond. I really like this much more sterner, kind of almost going back to early Sean Connery uh, type of take on him, a bit more violent, etc. Uh, then we had the Piers Brosnan, uh, f <laughs> which oh, Golden Eye's good, but after that, Jesus. <laughs> Uh, and then we got on to the wonderful Daniel Craig films, I think they've which been really good. Yeah, I've watched almost all the Daniel Craig ones. They're fucking reality. awesome. All right. And one of the uh, I, I didn't want to watch the whole thing. It's a 17-minute video, right? I just wanted to figure out if this was true or not. Uh, I, and I, I can just kind of give my own opinion. He's probably going to say the same thing that I am, so I don't need to go ahead and, you know, like, go through the whole thing. Uh, it's, it's true. Yeah, I mean, it, uh, I can just talk about, yeah, James Bond's a number, right? But here's the thing, right, is whenever you take something, this is my opinion, right? is that I think that whenever you take something and you change the gender of the main character, that changes the dynamic of the entire story. Because stories are based around society, and male and female roles in society are different. So whenever you change the gender in a role that's heavily based around society, then it's going to be completely different.
And I, I mean, I'm not saying that the movie's gonna suck. Like, honestly, the new James Bond movie could come out, this lady could play it, and it could be fucking awesome. Right? I, it, it's completely true, it could happen. But I think that in general, in general, you shouldn't change genders on like the characters, the main characters. Uh, unless there's like a specific reason, especially remember it's called James Bond, right? I mean, I, I, it, I don't see why you would do that. I mean, I think there's a lot of like female centric roles that you should probably do instead. And I can't really see it happening the other way around either. Uh, no, they cuck James. Yeah, we want Gary, <laughs> Gary Poppins. Gary Poppins flying away on an umbrella, right? <laughs> yeah, we'll have Gary Poppins and Wonder Man. <laughs> All right, let, let's see, what are the other ones we could do? Um, okay, uh, James Vod. Uh, what, what, what's the rest of these? Uh, Larry Croft. <laughs> uh, all, all right, Alan in Wonderland. <laughs> uh, let, let's see, Black Widower. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> Catman, he girl. Well, th no, they had She-Ra, right? I mean, they, they actually had like so that there's actually in the lore. That that's that's fine. Uh what, what was this? Tina Stark, yeah. Um Kenneth Everdeen, yeah. <laughs> Kevin Everdeen. I, I like Kevin. Uh, Kevin sounds better. Uh but yeah, I I don't know. I just think it's like it's like if you did it the other way around, I feel like everybody would just be like, yeah, this is stupid. It doesn't make a lot of sense. It's like weird, right? But like for some reason, like people are okay with it whenever it's, uh, you know, like a, a guy, basically. Uh, a, a girl replacing a guy. It's like the, the Ghostbusters thing is the same thing, right? And, and obviously, I, I just hope that the movie's good, right? And, and that's really the only thing. If the movie's good, I don't care. But uh, in general, I think that people should stay true to the source material, especially with creating something. Here's another thing, right? Is whenever you're creating something like James Bond, we were just talking a minute ago uh, about content like that that's just uh, basically they're using it to capitalize on an exist. What the fuck is that? Turn in the gold seeker Yarga for the hefty sum of gold. What the fuck? I've never gotten one of these before. Oh shit. Awesome. Okay. Curse of the Tides. Wait, what the fuck? Periodically subjected to curses. What? 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 What do you mean, dude? That's not fair. Uh, that's badass. Yeah, I guess so. Um, okay, let's see. Rank 18. Uh, if I can get this guy up to rank 20 today, uh, I can get a mount. And so, oh, by the way, guys, if you have Soundless up on your realm, if you have Soundless up on your realm, everybody go over to Najdatar and look for Soundless on your realm, all right? I want to make sure that I get a kill for Soundless before I leave this zone and I start doing the rest of this stuff, okay? You saw the Tertullian near the Alliance guy? Okay, well, I'll, I'll go over there and I'll take a look at it in a bit, okay? Uh, Drondor, cool. okay, there's one right there. I'll kill him. Perfect. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, Jeff. How about Jeff Proudmore? Uh, that'll be a good one for a while. Um, Steven, uh, Steven Windrunner instead of Sylvanas. It's a great one, too. Uh, Diane the Rock Johnson. Like, here's the thing, right? Is it, I, I don't know, I feel like, I feel like people, like, like to pretend that, like, men and women in society are, like, the exact same. But the truth is that there's, like, all kinds of different things, right? It's, like, more socially acceptable to, like, hold the girl, hold the door open for a woman than it is a man. Men are generally expected to pay for the, uh, you know, the first date, you know, and, and like there are these things that are just kind of like expected in society. And uh, are they going to change? I mean, I don't know, maybe in a hundred years or something like that. But you just, I mean, am I wrong about that? Hold the door open? Yeah, I mean, really? Oh, don't hold doors open for men? No, I always do. I hold the door open for everyone because uh, that's what normal people do. But, um, uh, uncross your lines. Okay, let's go this through here. Oh, fuck, it's not the bottom. I remember I accidentally killed her the other day, too. Same thing happened. Yeah, uh, girls buying me drinks. Exactly. What's a date? I play WoW. Um, it's a waste of money, uh, generally. Yeah, that's, that's what it is. Depends on where you are in the world. And, and, yeah, of course, but I'm talking about, like, obviously, in, like, our society. Uh, everything, of course, is uh, subjective to where you are in the world. I mean, that's just, uh, that, that's the way that life is. Um, is playing James Bond. Uh, she's not looking at it, fucking look at it. Well, I mean, if she's not playing James Bond, then it, it, it doesn't matter, right? I mean, that's a completely different conversation. Wait, what the fuck? Um, oh, this one's connected to that one. Wait, what the fuck? Am I messing this up? 
Okay, there we go. Imagine me messing that one up. That's like the easiest triangle of my life, and I still fucked it up. It's embarrassing. Uh, oh, well, what if a trans man was Bond? Uh, I, I don't think that they should focus heavily on the, the gender identity of James Bond. Uh, I just think it should be a guy. Like, I, I, you don't need to reinvent the wheel every single time. Sometimes uh, existing ideas are fine. Uh, if they want to make it something similar, then that's fine too. But uh, generally, I don't think you should try to reinvent the wheel with every single time, uh, uh, you know, every single, nor, every single new type of, uh, uh, of content. You know what I mean? Uh, project, I sort of say a project that's the same logic cancer operates on. Uh, well, I think it's like more. Well, fuck. This isn't going well at all. This is going really, really bad. I'm going to die, aren't I? What the fuck? All right, we're gonna have to. We're gonna bring in the uh, uh, the suicide bombers here. Uh, that's usually one of the best strats that you have. Okay, just a second here. All right, we're gonna bring in the suicide bombers. Let's go. Okay, here we go. And hopefully this one's gonna work. I'm pretty sure that it will. We'll see what happens. What the pet battle add-on's called? I really don't, honestly. Okay, so he's gonna hit him right there. That's a stun. All right, I see how it goes. And I'll blow up on him right there. I don't know if this is actually going to work. Yeah, I, I don't think this is going to work. He's going to kill me. Uh, this, this is bad. This is really, really bad. Okay, uh, so he's going to hit me right there. And let's see. All right, I'm going to hit him with the bomb. Explode. 385 health, man. Uh, let's see. I'm going to hit him with one more of these. Okay, there's a stun right there. I'm dead. I'm dead, dude. Uh, unborn Valkyrie and Icky. Yeah, I guess I might have to. I, I forgot, like, what I used to kill this guy. Uh, honestly, it's been kind of a while. Fuck, dude. Yeah, he's gonna kill me here. Uh, I don't even, I don't even want to finish the match. I know what's gonna happen. Okay, uh, let's see. What can I use instead of that? Okay, um, 